Hey guys, hope y'all are doing well. Today we are out here playing some Way of the Hunter, and I wanted to kind of look at the new map and the ammo changes that they made here recently. And I think that they added three, or there are two new ammo types now. And, uh, oh yeah, that's right, I used uh, the hollow points. I was taking a look at the hollow point ones that they added, and... So far, I mean, I'm loving the new ammo changes. I haven't really played with them that much. Like, I probably only played 30 minutes yesterday. <laughs> so, yeah, I don't know a whole lot about the ammo types. I want to actually take out... Let's see, which one do I want to take out? Ah, yeah, we'll take out the uh, 30-06. How about that? And we will also... Do we want to take out this 243? I'm trying to see... Um, you know what? Why don't we take out the 7mm 08? I have not used that very much. Let's go ahead and take a look at the ammo right quick. For the 7mm 08 and for the uh, 30-06. Let's see here. Now, s some of them have different muzzle energy velocities and different grains. <clears throat> so far... What I found to be the best in terms of range are the um, the middle ones, <clears throat> which is like the Barnes TSX, or for like the 300, it's the Power Shock rifle. Um, they typically have a lower grain, which is a little weird. Um, the muzzle velocity is a l usually a little slower. But the ones in the middle actually tend to have the longest range out of all the ammo types. But I I need to do a lot of testing and a lot of stuff to get some accurate information out for you all soon. But let me go ahead and buy some ammo and we're going to go test it on probably some Eurasian moose. And I want to see if we can't find us some uh, Arctic foxes, I think is what they are. But uh, yeah, let me go ahead and grab some ammo and we can go test it out. Oh, there we go. <coughs> Wolverines. Nice. Let's see if we can't get us a couple of those. Um, I knew that they were added, but I didn't know where I could find them. Holy crap, there's a lot. Okay, we really need these guys to... Stop moving. 7mm 08. Let's give her a shot. I missed that one. I got him. Missed that one. I don't miss twice. <laughs> Anyways, there we got him. Alrighty. Let's go ahead and check him out. That one may die, may not die. I'm going to shoot a couple more though. Alright, so I shot like five, I think. Yeah, five. I'm going to leave the rest. I don't want to completely shoot every living thing here. <clears throat> so, Eurasian Badger. So, yeah, we are quite over. So, 223 is what we should be using on these guys. Um, just a young female. Didn't really want to kill females, but oh well, we're just looking at them. Um, there's still <laughs> plenty around. And what do we got here? Overview. That is a young female. Another young female. And let's see, what is this one? Probably another young female, huh? Nope, young male. Uh, oh well, he's um, got bad genes anyways, so... Was that a wolf? I don't know what that was, actually. Anyways, uh, there is pheasant here as well. So that is pretty awesome. We're going to be hunting some of those as well. Uh, mature female. So basically we killed nothing but females and low fitness males. I mean, that I'm not going to complain about because I would like to have nice herds of animals. But, yeah, we killed a ton of females, which is, you know, kind of sucks. But it's kind of one of those oh well type of moments. But, anyways, there is plenty of other places to hunt them. And there will definitely be more. I mean, obviously, you just seen there's like a pack of 25 there. <laughs> but let me continue on to where I was going to go originally. We have a young male roe deer right here. I've yet to actually see what these guys look like. So we're going to go ahead and take him down. If we can. 
sneak a shot in between that tree, which we can't. Or at least we probably can, but I don't trust myself. And he will definitely go down. Alrighty, let's go take a look at him. There he is. Alright, well, what do we got here? So, I, I don't know if it's just me, but these look smaller than the other ones. Or maybe not. Maybe I'm just kind of having a crazy moment. I don't know. Anyways, um, 7 millimeter definitely put him down. No issue at all. That is exactly why I like that 7 millimeter. Alright, he is slowly making his way towards us, and, oh, he's going to give us a shot right here. Perfect. 30 out 6, no doubt put him down. Oh, no. Oh, this is going to be pretty interesting. <laughs> Listen here. Back away. Oh, no, I'm out of ammo. Holy crap, they actually try to attack you. That is new for sure. I've never gotten attacked by an animal before in this. Not like that at all. Small amount of blood and clear. Nope, not no more. <laughs> Holy crap, that was kind of scary. All right, here's our bear. It took a little bit of tracking, but he did indeed go down. That was freaking crazy. I did not expect to get attacked like that. But um, our first shot was... Oh, perfect. Right between the lungs. Awesome. Not even going to complain about that one. Holy crap. Barely went into him, though. And then the second shot, where do we hit on that one? If we wouldn't have clipped that bone, we would have got a easy heart shot. Easy heart shot. But... We got him, and see what was a 44.4 or 36 percent. Yep, he's a low fitness, so time to get him out of here. And we made a good stack of cash after getting him. All right, so <clears throat> I went ahead and returned to the base. Well, not the base, but our home. <laughs> and um, I grabbed some extra bullets, some different bullets. But um, I went ahead and opted with the 308 take it out because the last time I used that was whenever we tested it in that video to see which was the best. But yeah, I mean, we got to give it a try with the new ammo. I put the soft points in and we're going to see what it can do. And you can see I even have the old scope on it. Which I do like the scope too though, so I'm not going to complain about that. There he is right there. We got us a lynx. Let's see, can we get us a good shot here? I think we can. He's going to take a step right where we can't quite see him. Alright, that's a good shot. And we definitely got him on that one. Now, it's all a matter of tracking him down and looking at him. Alright, here he is. And let's take a look here. So, we hit a bone there and we got double lung. I'm really surprised he made it as far as he did. But yeah, he went down and we got him. Let's go ahead and take a look here. He is a low fitness, which is nice. And yeah, that's what the new links look like. They look really good. Okay, so that right there is the real big game. <laughs> Those guys, this will be the true test for the old 308 with this ammo. We're going to test it right now. That was mm, maybe a little bit too far forward. Uh, that was definitely too far forward, but there's two in him now. And hopefully he will go down. Alright, and here is our second bear. Let's go ahead and take a look at him. And the first shot was perfect. So that was really good. Man, we lost a lot of power over range. Oh, wait. We shot this one before with the 270. Holy crap. I'm so oh, I actually kind of remember that now. I'm actually really surprised that we didn't take him down. Uh, yeah, definitely not a lot of energy there. Take a look at the second one here. So this is the 308. 
308 hit the lung and the ribs so yeah that one it probably would have put him down and then shot three was way too far so we basically just clipped his shoulder blade and that was it but um yeah that one is down it was ooh, he was pretty far up there he probably would have made four star maybe five if we were lucky but um yeah that that's a little bit unfortunate but anyways that is that and i think i'm gonna call it here but i still want to take a look at the ammo before we go once again all right guys well i think that will be it for this video i want to thank you all for stopping by make sure to look forward for the next video and um, you can go ahead and subscribe and turn on the notifications which will alert you if you would want to but um yeah next video will be the test of the new weapons and the ammo but until next time guys thank you all for being here and also before i go let me know what your favorite rifle and way of the hunter is and i might include it within the video but thank you all for stopping by and i will see you all again very soon take care and stay blessed